Welcome to Comment Comeback, a show where I go back to some of my older videos and choose a bunch of really stupid comments and pick them apart. So for this particular episode of Comment Comeback, I've decided to choose one of my personal favourites, that being the Sonic the Hedgehog video. Now the reaction to this one has surprised me a little bit because I had no idea how irrational, stupid, moronic, uh, every, just go to thesaurus.com and uh, choose all the different definitions for idiot. And uh, that's what the comments were for the most part, and still are to this day. But really, what did I expect? This is the internet. So without further ado, let's just get into the comments. So let's just get rid of some of the insulting comments that have literally no use to anyone. You suck. Fuck you. Just go fuck off. Go F yourself. You suck. Sonic the Hedgehog is the best video game hero in the world, and he's ten times better than whatever video game you play, so shut up, you asshole. Whatever you say, Joshua. Well, fuck you, dude. There are some of us who like Sonic the Hedgehog, and we have characters for it. Just... Uh... No, I'm not even gonna touch that one. So this mental patient was kind enough to uh, try and censor his swears to me by putting you fuck bitch which doesn't even make any sense in any context imaginable. But any, even then he failed to censor it. He put the star in between the F and the U, but he still put the U, so it still says fuck. Well done. We all fucking hate you ass piece of shit come out of Mario fat ass of haters. I have no idea what any of that means. If you could decipher it for me, please could you email me at I don't give a shit at gmail.com. Thank you. You hate something you have little to no contact with, okay, we all do fuck off. Now that's an uh, argument I see a lot. Another one of those bullshitty ones that really does make no sense when you break it down. Because ultimately, you can't escape Sonic the Hedgehog. He's like a sarlacc pit that you've been digested by for a thousand years. Everything, it's all over DeviantArt, it's all over YouTube. His crap is everywhere. And being a fan of gaming, I see his bloody face everywhere. I do try to actively avoid seeing him at all costs, but it's nearly impossible on the internet, so I would if I could, butthole magic. Should have read the name first. Jesus Christ. And um, as regards to your fuck off thing, um, I would if I could, but being an avatar in the, on the internet makes it relatively difficult to leave because I don't actually exist as a form in the digital space, so that makes no sense. Fuck you, you're an ass assaholic bitch. Thumbs up on this comment if you like Sonic. Well, first off, luckily no one was stupid enough to uh, give him any likes on that, so it makes him look even more of a moron, but uh, what's an assaholic bitch? Seriously, if you know, email me at I don't give a sh I fucking hate this guy. He's a British asshole who insults my re religion because he uses the Lord's name in vain. Now, I don't even know why I featured this one, actually. Um, I'm immediately regretting it because I did go on his channel or his Google Plus page, or whatever the hell it is, I have no idea anymore, thanks to Google Plus YouTube integration, but he just posts this, this same comment on a bunch of videos, including Ashen's and some Australian's channel, and he just changes British to Australian, so... I'm sure you're a satisfied person. Super amazing Rick Satan 972 strikes back. Great name, by the way, just the best. How could you hate Sonic, you fa- You know, this is tiring. All these, obviously, must they must be around 10, 9, 10 years old. They've all got Sonic or a Sonic picture in their name. And it's just, it's embarrassing for the entire fan base. I had no idea that the, well, I can't say the whole majority from this small excerpt from my video, but a large portion at least search out these kind of dumb videos. And my video was just completely a joke. At one point, there's a, an obviously photoshopped picture of me with the photo, with the Sonic hat on, with a plane in the background chasing me, and it says something like communists trying to stop me from spreading Sonic something. Really, how thick, how low of an IQ do you have to have to take this seriously? I mean, seriously, if it, if it gets to you that much, dislike it, whatever, I get it, but this? This? If something can insult you so personally there's something else wrong with you on another level that isn't to do with just the video if it hits your nostalgia thing and makes you feel bad because of that I guess 
but I mean, you're not a rational person and you should probably not be using the internet at all. Went a bit long on that one. Fuck off you don't like him, some of us do. Now stop making these ridiculous videos about why you hate him, dick. So he implies that I've made more than one video about Sonic. I care so little about him, his character, his entire brand, why I would even put that much attention into such a thing is uh, mind-boggling to me, but whatever, it's fine, you like him, I don't know, need to be a uh, doucher about it, but... So I, I replied to him, I just quoted the very beginning of the video that says, uh, uh, what, surprisingly enough, this is my opinion. To which he replied, yes, this is your opinion and you don't need to make a video about it. He like he highlighted the you are as if it was supposed to mean something, but he just pointed out his own grammatical error, making him look even more of a brain-dead child. And again, this is another sort of argument. It's not even, it, doesn't, it barely even counts as an argument, but whatever. Uh, for why I shouldn't make videos as if you don't need to make a video about it because it's my opinion, right? So in that case no review should exist no Political opinions no like a whole section of YouTube sh just shouldn't exist at all These people they get so personally upset with it that they feel like it shouldn't exist even though they have the option to just close it I don't, me personally, like, if so, if there's a video that I happen to wind up on and I don't like it, I'll dislike it, maybe. I might not even do that, I might just close it before I even get to the end of it, because I don't care. I don't let anything get to me. Say, for example, I, I like the movie Man of Steel, loads of people don't. I don't give a shit, it doesn't change the way I feel about it. That's me, I don't care. I can justify why I like it, I understand why people don't, that's it. It's as simple as that. You don't need to be a brain-dead, just stupid, moronic person. And I'm, run I'm just running out of... My, my vocabulary isn't broad enough to for all these insults and what to call these people. So that's enough of the insults. Let's move on to things that are less mind-numbing. Question mark times ten. I respect you do not like Sonic, but there was not reason for all that. No offense. Um, okay, I understand not liking the video that's fine but please when leaving a comment can you make it meaningful can it be helpful especially if you don't like it i want the people who don't like it to tell me why i don't care if you don't like it but just say why I mean, even if you like most of my videos and i put one out and you don't like it comment and and just say why and that applies to any of the youtubers that you like and follow if you comment why you didn't like a specific video of them, it's infinitely more helpful than the hundreds if not thousands of comments of people just calling you a moron or an asshole or whatever they want to say. Play the Sonic games for Genesis, you'll see why they're awesome. Now if I did decide to do that, I can almost guarantee 100% that I would regret every second of it because I just don't care about Sonic or ever liked any of the games. Why just why would you say that? Because I don't like Sonic the Hedgehog. It is not a difficult thing to comprehend. So this person said uh, Sonic, because um, at the end of the video I asked who do you prefer, Mario or Sonic, they put Sonic, and then after that they commented, oh, and I'm not going to subscribe to you unless you have good opinions. First off, I'm pretty certain I've never asked for subscribers. All I've said is that I appreciate all the interaction that I get from people. And second of all, if you don't appreciate my opinion or what I have to say, why would I want you as a as a as a, as a, as a, as a, as a subscriber at all? Just so you know, I did actually put that S thing on. I, I don't have a, 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 a stutter. I don't have a stutter. Are you some kind of alien because everyone who's a human likes Sonic? Is it, uh, well... Well, maybe... Well, perhaps... Well, Sonic at least has a storyline in most of his games, while Mario doesn't have a solid one. It's always just save the princess from the giant turtle king and the goddamn power-ups. They are all just as many power-ups in Mario as there are characters in Sonic. While I hate the voice acting and bits of the design, I still enjoy the gameplay. Now, this is fair enough, all in all, but uh, I do have to say, sometimes it's okay for a game to not have a story, as long as everything else backs it up. Mario Galaxy is one of the greatest games of all time, in my opinion, and that has absolutely no story at all. Now, I would like them to experiment with that a bit more, but 
I really don't see attempting like a really bad story with Sonic and not having all the gameplay super refined like it is in Mario. It's like I would rather have non-story but have a really fun game to play. So that's where I stand on that. And I don't see the Mario power-ups thing as a uh, as you know as awful as the Sonic characters. It's like there are, there are a bunch of Mario characters and most of them are charming and whatever. But the Sonic ones, it's just like, okay, you got all these horrible animals that all look stupid. What of it? Sonic is innocent. I like Sonic. What you're saying about Sonic is not true. Not true at all. So it's not true that I said that I don't like Sonic, and I made it quite clear, I think, for the most part. May I can see I can see one thing about the video that could piss you off if you're a genuine Sonic fan. And that's when I compared him to Mario, saying maybe heavily implying that they just copied Mario. Because, you know, up until some people pointed it out to me, that's kind of what I thought. I w to me, Mario is a genuine icon, and Sonic is a corporate figure designed purely for nothing but marketing and to sell things. That's just me. That's just what I think. Now, I had a couple of people say this say very same thing. God, why do you make these videos? It's bad enough that you make horrible remarks on people's childhood interests. Oh, I'm just so insulting. I'm really destroying their childhood. We're going so far as to shit all over them too. I got nothing against you or what you stand for. Well, apart from all the insults I just said a couple of sentences ago. Just leave our childhood out of it, thanks. Well, judging by the way that uh, you can't control the viewer base and the ages of everyone that watches your videos, can range from five-year-olds to, you know, 80-year-olds, if not older, how am I supposed to pick and choose which childhood, which childhoods um, I need to avoid, or whatever you're implying? I don't care. I'm gonna say what I say. It's people's, oh no, I don't want to insult someone's childhood. I'm not gonna avoid talking about things because I don't want to ruin people's childhoods. Let's say I've, I have nostalgia for something like the Star Wars prequels because I was very young when they came out, so I just enjoyed them purely because it was more Star Wars. I can see now in retrospect that they are awful movies. I don't care if anyone calls them awful. It doesn't ruin anything I think. I, my childhood was in my childhood, and it stays that way. Sonic is awesome because he's not slow like Mario. He's got better powers than Mario, and he's always had better music than Mario. God. And they have more well-designed characters. <laughs> They're Mario, and their music is mostly awesome, just said that twice, and epic, and they have more replayable games in the series, <coughs> like Sonic Adventure and Sonic Adventure 2. The KO, KO Garden, I think it's Chaos Gardens, is awesome, and they have more toys that actually look better than Mario figures, and Sonic characters actually have voices. I really don't want to hear those sounds like Ma that Mario makes uh, in a comic book series. Whatever. Nearly every one of those is super dumb in my eyes. I can't see anyone who has any appreciation for the entire gaming spectrum. Someone who want, who reads about games, who's into games as a whole, and isn't just a, a, uh, an idiot who just focuses on one console or anything and just accepts it as a whole, who can honestly defend Sonic over Mario and say it has better games and better music. Because I think that's just a ludicrous thing to say. Go back and play the original Sonic compared to the original Mario. There is no competition at all. Mario trumps it every single time, in my opinion. You might have some nostalgia that makes you think um, that make that, ha that makes you have more of an attachment to Sonic, and that's fine. But fundamentally, I think Mario is a much more sound series from beginning to end. If Sonic was in battle with Mario, Sonic would win because Mario would be no match for Sonic because of Sonic. Oh, Sonic's Sonic's natural speed. Just check out Death Battle on YouTube, whatever. And Sonic, and obviously Sonic is way better than Mario. Well, I suppose that's a very childish way to look at it. Um, he's better because he could win in a fight, but I don't think that way, and that's not going to convince me even in the slightest. You are the cruelest thing alive. You know, there was a time where I thought the comments from my original PewDiePie video were going to be the stupidest, and I never thought anything could top that. I, I didn't have the clairvoyance necessary to predict just the goddamn morons that use YouTube. I mean, I'm the I'm the cruelest thing alive. Okay, what you want it? N nope. And finally, to round this all off, the 
funniest one I think I could find. And if you just like Sonic and his looks, doesn't mean that you can just run around with your hat and stopping people to buy their games. This person genuinely thought, because I said it in a YouTube video, that I go around wearing a Sonic hat, warning people about buying Sonic games. He genuinely thinks that I do that. Or just insulting about his voice and many other things about Sonic. Yes, I know this is your opinion, and I'm not against it. And I'm just against the fact that you're insulting him. So he just says, I'm not against it, but I actually am. Do these people understand how anything works? Do they, do they work at all? On a cognitive level. I mean, they're obviously children. All of these people are obviously children. That's, that's it. Hundreds of hundreds of idiot children just waltzing around the internet, not knowing anything or having any consequences for it because in real life if you had a presentation on why you didn't like Sonic no one would say any of this you wouldn't have the crowd going fuck you I like Sonic I got nostalgia for Sonic fuck you you're an idiot you wouldn't get that would you it's just insane how the internet creates a barrier where these stupid children can run around being morons I'm so sick of this I'm so glad this was the last comment I couldn't take any more of it Jesus it was bad enough having to go back into the comment section of that video it is uh, awful. It is terrible. Ah, jeez Louise. Lemon squeeze. So that is it. I've had enough of this. You know, usually I have a lot more fun recording these because they're just so silly, the comments. But these are just, it's, there's a bar. And this goes beyond the bar and it's just, I can't have fun. It's just so st stupid. I, I must have said stupid, stupidly stupid amount of times because there's just no other way to describe them. Well, there probably is, but someone uh, like me is not the, the person to do it. So, thanks for getting this far. This one has been horribly, horribly long. Hopefully you enjoyed my suffering. That's usually the, the type of thing that people enjoy uh, watching on YouTube, hence the success of the Saw series and other such things. So, thanks for watching. All comments and ratings are appreciated. I'll see you next time once I've recovered from this crap. Bye.